Uh, next, let's look at a uh, couple of examples, how these collection actions are applied. Uh, typically, they are not used in silo. Uh, they are used in combination. So on the left-hand side is an early stage example on day zero. Uh, that represents the first day become to, uh, becomes delinquent. Uh, so it really is on the uh, cycle day uh, when the statement is generated. Uh, so typically you can print the state message that's called the state message one one. Um, each number represents a certain verbiage. Okay, so then uh, you give the customer 10 days. Uh, in this example, uh, if the customer still doesn't pay the minimum deal, then on day 10, you send out a letter. Okay, so letter with the ID 105 represents certain verbiage. Uh, then you give another 10 days. On day 20, uh, if the customer still doesn't pay, uh, you put the customer in the calling queue uh, with ID 03. Here uh, is assigned a priority of a medium. Okay, so then we need to have the uh, call center staff begin to uh, uh, call the customer. So this is an example of early stage LinkedIn accounts. Uh, on the right hand side, we have a late stage example. Uh, let's say it's uh, day 120. Okay, so it's already 120 days past. Uh, the account is entering cycle five. Uh, so we'll print a statement message. Okay, so, but also we need to send a, a letter right away on day 120, right? So, uh, probably telling the customer you, you lose your credit uh, privilege, you really need to pay this up. Uh, and also this account should be, be placed in the calling queue uh, 50, uh, which is assigned a priority of a high. Okay, you see that uh, once in late stage, everything has to happen way on the uh, uh, statement date.